I see you. I see you. Hey everyone, Chris here, and welcome back to Voices of the Void. We are currently on day 26, picking up right where we left off last time. Let's have a quick sip of coffee from our new coffee machine. That thing's actually amazing. Let's just do so many more things now. Thanks to the comments from you guys, we actually have quite a number of things to do. So I've been told to gather seven skulls and take it to the Stonehenge thing over there and something will happen. I've also been told to go to the cave at 333. And then also to go back to that big hole where we found the crowbar and kind of dig around there. I'm kind of thinking we start off with that one and maybe by night time we'll head over to the cave. So let's get started with that. Okay, here we are back at the hole. Let's go ahead and get the metal detector out. I'm assuming I need that to find whatever I'm supposed to dig up. That's what I'm guessing. Oh, there's definitely something around here. Oh, it seems like it's right here. Okay, that was not far at all. I did bring the shovel, right? I think I did. Ooh, what the heck is this? Okay, I haven't seen that. Uh, let's get a little bit of a look at it. Okay, so it seems like it doesn't actually have a texture. Uh, let's put that into our inventory. And let's see what it says. Detector. Yeah, no info. Uh, let's hold that. It seems like it clicks. Wait, what? It's beeping. I don't know what for, though. I'm so confused right now. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't seem like it's speeding up or slowing down, kind of like the metal detector. Maybe it's used for certain events or something, I don't know. Oh wait, hold on, okay. I just walked over here and now it's beeping faster. And there's a little blue light. It doesn't seem to matter where I'm pointing, it's kind of just more if I'm in an area of something. Oh, now it's turning green, what the heck? Oh, I'm so confused right now. Oh, now it's turning yellow too. What the heck? Let's head up. Maybe it means something in the room. Maybe it finds us items. I don't know. Is there something here? I don't really see anything if I'm being honest. Okay, let's put that away. I mean, we have a grappling hook. Maybe we could kind of check here. Is there anything? Maybe on top? <laughs> I don't know. Let's see if I could kind of swing over there. Oh, oh crud. Okay, broke my legs, and I think I lost the grappling hook up there. Okay, this time it's for sure stuck. I, I really can't grab it from there for whatever reason. Uh, let's go ahead and try this out right over here. Maybe it'll turn red or something? Oh. What is what is supposed to be here? So it's beeping like crazy right over here. Uh, I just don't see anything. Maybe it's up there? <laughs> Who knows? Okay, I did get the grappling hook, but I just cannot find a good way to get up there. So how about we head back home? I'll grab the- ooh, that was a miss on the jump there. Uh, let me grab the alarm clock and we'll head over to the cave and see what happens at 3.33. There's something going on there, I'm just not sure what. Okay, we're getting pretty close to the time, so 3.23 right now. I'm assuming what I have to do is kind of be inside the cave and attempt like this walk in over here where it says I can't. 3.33? Okay, maybe I have to try a little bit differently because nothing happened the first time. So 332, 333, maybe I just run in here. I will not go in there. Oh, hold on. Is this the uh, thing? Is this what I'm here for? I think it might be, right? Or is it, has that always been there? Um, hold on. Let me reload and see if that wasn't there or not. Okay, so yeah, it wasn't there before. Okay, okay. So uh, let's do that again, I guess. So maybe that's what we're here for. Spawns at 333. 332. Let's head inside. And yeah, it pops in right there as you just saw. Okay. I was uh I was kind of assuming it had something to do with this area over here, the actual cave itself, but hey, I'm cool with that. Okay, let's head back home and check out the daily task. Oh, I have to carry this a long way. Okay. Oh wait, hold on, okay. Um I was heading back, but I think I might have missed an event. While I was waiting over there, or maybe this triggered that. Yeah, you guys could see that giant smoke cloud over there. Uh, huh. I'm sure that's good. Uh, what is that? What the heck? I've never seen this. Is this new? It's like tree platforms. Has this always been here? And I just... Wait, there's a whole spaceship here. What the heck? Have I been missing out on this the whole time? Oh no, this is where the smoke is. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, there's a whole campfire. They were just big chilling over here. <laughs> okay. Um, what do we got? I mean, obviously got the spaceships here. I don't know if I could actually interact with them. 
Got some of these things. Oh, I can sleep here. Can I take these? Shift E. Oh, I can move them. Okay. Uh, got this super bright light. I'm assuming that doesn't run out of battery. What just fell? Something just fell over here. Okay, just an acorn. Cool, cool, cool. Don't scare me like that. What is this? This thing is too hot. Uh, that kind of looks like a bomb, but not really. I don't know. And then a backpack. Can't open. What do you mean it can't open it? Man, I kind of wonder if I was supposed to maybe bring my grappling hook to somehow get up there. Uh, I mean, I'm not really seeing anything actually here. Okay, can't really do too much with anything here. So let me just pick this up. And I guess we'll take that back home and start on the daily task, at least for a bit. I still do want to check out that area kind of outside the map. Someone said there was a hole in the gate so I could get through there. And it always gets me terrified when stuff falls. Wait, did you guys hear that? It sounded like glass breaking. I have no idea where that came from though. It sounded kind of over there to the right. Um, stuff is getting really weird here. <gasps> I see you. I see you. <gasps> oh, that's terrifying. It was camouflaged or invisible pretty much. You could kind of see that faint outline. Oh my gosh, that's, that's some horror game level stuff right there. Uh, is that just permanently around the map now? That's a little scary. Uh, let's get inside. Kind of walk up. Let's close that. Uh, am I safe? That was so creepy. Is it on the map, maybe? Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Yeah, because it sounded like glass broke. And then that thing kind of ran at me. So there might just be someone... Running around the map now. Maybe they're from that camp I just saw. That probably makes a lot of sense. Uh, what's our daily task? So three level zeros and one level two. And then Tango and Echo. Okay, pretty simple. Let's go ahead and do that really quickly. Because I have zero credits and I'm almost out of food. Well, I mean I am out of food. So let's try to focus on this. You know, I'm not going to lie. This kind of just turned into a real horror game. It's like rainy and cloudy and dark. And then now I know there's an invisible monster roaming around. Yeah, this has only got really intense here. Uh, let's lock that up too. I don't feel safe here anymore. Okay, just sent off a report, so the drone should be coming in soon, and we should get some points very quickly. I was also told to come over here to this computer and type in alien, and something might happen. Uh, let's see. Behind me? <gasps> oh, that's terrifying, but it's just a cutout. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Oh, that's kind of cool though. Uh, we'll place that over here. Kind of looking now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll protect us, right? Totally. Okay, let me go to sleep for a bit, and then let's head west to try to get out of the map. I do want to do the skulls at some point, but, um, yeah, I think it's going to take me a while to find them. Why are there so many mushrooms here? Oh, that just disappeared. Okay. Ooh, okay, so it seems like we got the hole here. Um, F off. You don't see it. Forget now. You will die. There's monsters. They eat you. You die. Can I just, uh... Walk over here. Okay. Looks like I'm outside the map. Um, I don't know if it actually just kind of goes on forever. I'm assuming there's some sort of invisible wall then. Or maybe I fall off and die. Uh, I kind of want to head this way. Because this last time. We kind of saw in the little front outpost looking thing. That there's stuff inside. So let's make that our goal for right now. Oh hey there it is. Okay I kind of had to cross the river over there. But let's see if we can get inside. Yeah, there's no door here. Ooh, lots of food. That's always good to see. Ooh, one of those chocolate bars. And then... Uh, ooh, wait. Why is this one black? It doesn't even have a red light or anything. Okay, that's kind of ominous. Anything inside here? Okay, can't open that. Some fuel. Man, I really should have brought the ATV. I don't know why. Oh, yeah, there. see, there is like an invisible wall here. Maybe I just had to go down a little bit more. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, wait. Uh, maybe not. Okay. And yeah, not too much else here. So let's just grab that. I do want to kind of follow this path for a little bit at least. Kind of see where it leads me. I'm assuming it'll take me to somewhere important. Seems like it goes on even over there. 
Oh, okay. There's a invisible wall here. Okay, okay. That makes sense. And yeah, I guess we'll just kind of follow this around for a bit, see where it leads us. Unless maybe I hit another invisible wall somewhere. Uh, also, maybe this is a good opportunity to see if this does anything. I'll just kind of have this on beeping around and see if it detects anything. I'm assuming there has to be something kind of hidden out here, right? Okay, but actually, I might have messed up by not bringing the ATV. I, I just can't climb this hill over here. That's a little unfortunate. Okay, since the other way is kind of too steep, let's head this way. But is it just me? Or does it look like there's something in that mountain right there? That looks like maybe a rock. Um, I mean, we'll try heading over there, see what happens, right? Yeah, I hit the invisible wall right now. Okay, okay. But hey, maybe that's something worth checking out with the drone at some point. I don't know if maybe that invisible wall isn't all that tall, you know? And maybe the drone could fly right over it and check it out. All right, looks like we're about to pass where that kind of alien cave is. And yeah, I kind of expected I might have some trouble here just because it gets really steep. Uh, the detector hasn't picked up anything yet, unfortunately. I mean, I'm still not completely sure what it's actually for or how it's used. It seemed to pick something up by that satellite, so maybe I need to try the other satellites? Who knows? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, there's something out here. Okay, maybe this wasn't all for nothing. I was getting a little discouraged there. What the heck are these things? Okay, they look like giant dolls. Yeah, yeah, it's like a bunny person thing or something. And then... I have no idea what this is. It's got like hair and everything. Okay, so at least something kind of hidden. And this thing is not even detecting anything. I was going to put that away to stop the beeping. Okay, I wonder... Kind of wonder if maybe that's the only thing out here. Because if it's out of the map, I don't feel like the developer would put something super important. But I don't know. There's lots of like trolley kind of fun stuff in the game so who knows and then I think I might have to stop over here because I kind of feel if I go down that hill I'm gonna be trapped in that little ravine okay okay I just really don't want to repeat of last time where I got stuck I wonder can I jump this I have to be able to what's going on okay now there's an invisible wall pretty much on all the fences I feel like that wasn't there before who knows then I think what I'll do for next time is charge up the drone and kind of use that to fly around outside the map and then if we see something from that, oh look, there's the alien over there. But if we see something with the drone, then I'll kind of walk around and try to find it on foot or with the ATV. So how about we leave it there for now? Uh, not too many signals or anything of interest like that. But hey, we had lots of kind of weird things happen around the map with like that event over there, the invisible alien, and then now we're kind of out here too. Oh. What the heck was that?